November 5, Tuesday of the 31st week in Ordinary Time A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke One of those at table with Jesus said to him, Blessed is the one who will dine in the kingdom of God. He replied to him, A man gave a great dinner to which he invited many. When the time for the dinner came, he dispatched his servant to say to those invited, Come, everything is now ready. But one by one, they all began to excuse themselves. The first said to him, I have purchased a field and must go to examine it. I ask you, consider me excuse. And another said, I have purchased five yoke of oxen, and am on my way to evaluate them. I ask you, consider me excuse. And another said, I have just married a woman, and therefore I cannot come. The servant went and reported this to his master. Then the master of the house, in rage, commanded his servant, Go out quickly into the streets and alleys of the town, and bring in here the poor and the crippled, the blind and the lame. The servant reported, Sir, your orders have been carried out, and still there is room. The master then ordered the servant, Go out to the highways and hedgerows, and make people come in that my home may be filled. For I tell you, none of those men who were invited will taste my dinner. The Gospel of the Lord The Invited the storyline of the parable of the great feast builds up on the number three. Three sets of people are invited. Three excuses are given by the first group who are presumed to come. Three times the servant is sent out to ask people to come to the feast. The structure tells us that the second and the third groups, the poor and the crippled, the blind and the lame, and the people in highways and hedgerows are just as important in the God's eyes as the first invitees. Without the servant's second and third rounds, there would be no story. By rejecting Jesus, the Pharisees and lawyers, those who were invited first, will not taste the banquet that is open to all. They have come out with different excuses for refusing the great banquet that Jesus offers. They are displeased with the fact that Jesus opens the banquets to all kinds of people.